What is up everybody? It's Gorilla Man here back with another Car Mechanic Simulator 2015 video and in today's video we're just gonna be doing a little bit of some uh, some work on some cars and we fixed some things um, probably no probably no restoration today probably just gonna be working on some things so we'll just get started and get right into it so we'll start with this BMW M3 I think I'm not quite sure all right, so we're gonna start with replacing the timing parts. So we'll just hop in right here. Let's pull, pull out this radiator and radiator fan first. Okay, yeah, you can definitely tell some things are bad here. All right, we'll pull this stuff out. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's been a little bit since I played this, so I'm gonna be a tad bit rusty when it comes to doing some things. But, should be good. Alright, what else do they need? Timing belt. Okay, so we gotta pull okay, so we gotta pull this entire timing apart and then we gotta pull the heads off so that we can get to these timing chains. Which is gonna be annoying. Alright, bounce up here. Alright, there we go. Oh, gotta get the throttle off first. So the real reasons I really never did uh these or I stopped doing like these repair jobs was because these repair jobs are basically the exact same thing as the um, restorations except for everything's not nearly as straightforward and you don't get as much money so it kind of sucks a little bit but eh, it's something new or it's something different for me to try uh, I haven't this is oh whoa, whoa, I just realized that this car is a supercharger on it. that's freaking crazy um, but yeah, so I usually just don't do them because they don't yield as much money and that's pretty much the whole point is to get the most money you can. But yeah, so this car's a supercharger on it. I did not realize that until just now. That's pretty crazy actually. Alright, so these are going to be all underside of the car, which is a good thing. Except for this one, pop off this exhaust manifold. This will be loud when accelerating. Underneath the uh, repair part, there it is, exhaust manifold. All right, let's go pick up some parts. Exhaust manifold, duh, 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 right there. Oh man, I wish I would have kept all the parts from my old. Uh, or for the other restorations because I would have plenty of money for all of or plenty of money plenty of parts Plenty of extra parts. All right, we're gonna hop down underneath Okay, air filters good just check in so they're gonna have us redo all the body panels. Oh Frames are good. Okay. Never mind. So yeah, we're gonna have to tear apart some of these Body panels, you know, we'll just pull all these off while we can We'll hit them all on the, uh, see, yeah, these, these ones are bad. Hmm. Pull the headlights. We'll just repair these really quick, see what we can do. Alright, we repaired everything. Now for the assembly. Oh, oh, whoa. Okay, okay, we have to buy... Okay, so we're gonna need to buy a new front bumper. Um, FMW. All right, there we go. And for this, we're not gonna go any of the expensive parts or anything like that because uh, there's not really any point. We're not gonna be able to keep the car or anything. So we wanna save as much money on this as possible, which is one of the reasons that I was gonna say, oh, I should have used all those spare parts because instead of just like selling them, I could have used them on this and I probably would have saved a few extra bucks, but wasn't thinking ahead that far and I kind of, kind of messed up but it's okay all right there you go. all that's good they want us to do the hood too they did not all right so we will just start tearing off all the these wheels say so I think you guys will notice that the rest these restorations are uh, not restorations these um repair jobs are I don't even know why I'm taking that off I don't need to repair it so these repair jobs are basically the exact same things as the restorations but they are 
a little bit more annoying. All right, let's pull off that exhaust pipe, and then let's check these bushings. Uh, bushings are always usually bad. We'll just replace it. Actually, that one looks good. Let's leave that one. Hop on over to this side, check out what we got. Ooh, see, I don't even think a double wish, but like a shock absorber, they, they can't even rust like that, so it's just a little weird, a little bit un unrealistic too, so. But in other news, everybody, um, I figured out, I uh, did a little online research. Uh, the new car mechanic simulator will be called, oh yeah, if, if you don't know, you knew, there is going to be another car mechanic simulator for PC coming out. Um, not sure about Xbox or PS4, but there will be a new one coming out and it's going to be called Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. And it be, will be released during the 2017 year, so this year. Um... They, I kind of talked about it in one of my previous videos. I don't remember which one it was, but they have things like barn finds, which is pretty sure it's something that they kind of stole from Forza because Forza had barn finds where you go into a barn, you find a really old car. Pretty much the same thing. Um, you can find like all the information that I found on things like Playway, something like that. I think that's the makers of the game. Um, Playway, they have a whole like developer's diaries, what they call it behind it but yeah so no new game um a bunch of new cars i'm pretty sure that most of the cars that they're doing now they're gonna have they're gonna be licensed so we're not gonna be getting like these fmws they'll, they'll call it bmw um which is good for the car manufacturers and this is it's also good for us because um i would rather just have like be able to see what car is what instead of having to go online and find out what it actually was supposed to be or what they meant to do so i mean i'm sure there'll still be a few but i think that's be pretty cool all right pulling apart all these parts see it's nice though because we don't have to like change everything because we're not going for everything 100 percent i think we're actually going for everything to be 90 percent um total throughout the car which is would which will happen if we just um repair all the necessary parts that they ask us to repair all right so then we'll go in here and we'll check and see if everything is like found then we should be good all right i think we have everything done so we will just start putting everything back together all right so let's just type in all right so this this part gets a little bit more difficult Actually, you know what we'll do? I remember what I used to do. All right, so we need belt tensioner, two timing belts, and a water pump pulley. So this is what I used to do. So I'd just like look at the list and I would just go through and you'd be able to get everything super easy. So we need the water pump and we need the water pump pulley. We need the bottom two bottom suspension arms. Oh, bottom. And then we need a double wishbone. We need inner tie rod, outer tie rods. So we need both tie rods, not tear, tie. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I am excited for Car Oh, I bought two. Oops. I'm excited for Car Mechanic 2017 or 2018. Um, I think it's going to be really good because. If you could see, they've just gotten better as the as they as they've been making their games. They just keep putting more content and more stuff into it. So I'm looking forward to what they have to do. So we need rear shock absorber A and rear spring. We're gonna need one of those. Um. Your suspension arm A and upper arm. Suspension arm A, suspension arm A, upper arm. Then we need four rubber bushings. Rubber bushings, one, two, three, four. One of those. And we also need a wheel hub bearing. All right, that's done. So then we need inner tie rods and outer tie rods. Some more of them, actually. 
All right, and we need sway bar. So let's just type in sway. Sway bar front end link B. And then the end links, two of those. And then we need two catalytic converters. Two of those, two exhaust pipes. I don't remember if we bought these, but I'm gonna buy them anyways. And then we need a front exhaust pipe V8. And we need both mufflers. So we need one middle muffler. What else was it? And a rear muffler. And I already bought the rear muffler. All right, I think we're good. I think we're ready to re reassemble everything. And see, this process should go pretty smooth, pretty quick, because we're just putting everything back together. Oh, did I buy the rear wrong? <laughs> did I buy the wrong rear drive axle? I thought it was, I thought it was the B axles. Oh dang! Okay, there's some wasted money. All right. That kind of sucks for me though. There we go. Uh, spring caps. There we go. Pop around over here, rear suspension. Pop a new rubber bushing in. All right. Shock absorber. Did I buy one of these? I did not have to, okay. See, that's the weird thing. Like, it's everything's so much different now that I'm not doing the performance parts for everything. Like, I, this is so much simpler, so much easier than everything else. All right, rear muffler. Done. See, I have to put. I only have to put in like a fraction of the stuff that I would normally do. Like normally, sometimes I have to split videos up into two parts because it takes so dang long to do some of these things. But this one isn't that bad. There we go. Suspension arm. All right, got the tires on. Gonna pop around here. Oh. Can't see. There we go. All right, go over here. Get this classic rim. All right. Oh, I've had. I didn't realize I have a performance catalytic converter still. All right, then this front section should not be too bad. There really wasn't that much. There's more in the rear than there was in the front, so. Oh, it should only take me two minutes to do this one, and then take me another minute to do timing. And then I think we'll be golden, and we'll see how much money we make from these. Because I don't remember how much money you make from these, but I know for a fact it's not going to be like $75,000. It's going to be like ten at most. Which, I mean, I get, because you don't have to put in like the original money to purchase the car. But, that still kind of sucks. All right. Oh no, putting the wrong one. That's weird, because usually it just scrolls over to the first one and I don't have to go back and move it around, but I did that time. All right. Brake pads, brake calipers, there we go. There we go, now we're flying. Now this is going good. I need to clear out my inventory. I got so much stuff in there, and I know I always say that. All right. Front springs, and then everybody stay tuned for tomorrow or Sunday on uh, the squad's channel. We're gonna be doing a unboxing of okay, yes, we need to go up here. We're gonna do an unboxing of a bunch of stuff that uh, campingsurvival.com sent us. So I will be in that video along with him, and I think it will be pretty fun actually. So yeah, anybody who watches the squad, uh, stay tuned for that. I'm not sure when he's going to post it. We haven't filmed it yet, but we will be very, very soon. All right, timing covers. Oh, these red timing covers get me every time. I just hate them so much. I feel like they're good only on Honda cars, and that's it. 
mainly because they just get in my way and I can't tell what's what. And Honda, uh, or like Civics, Honda Red, Civics, stuff like that. Same color. Ignition coils. Oh, oh, call cover. Oh man, we can't put any uh, oil. We don't get to put any oil. Oh, I already had an extra water pump. Dang. See, that's why I need to go through and clear my inventory so that none of that happens. And I don't ever have to run into this issue. Alright, so my assumption, or my guess, is I'm going to make... Oh, not the radiator. I think I'm going to make $6,000 off this. Um... Yeah, I bet you I bet you will make 6k off of this, which in real life that's like an insane amount of money. Like like that would be absolutely awful if you were like the person paying for it. But and I mean in the game it's not not noted that much. All right, radiator, radiator fan. So we got check 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 and all we need to do is paint this sucker a good color. Um I'm going to go with like this kind of this kind of blue right here. I'm gonna do it this kind of blue. Let's try to at least. I like it. Let's go with that. Oh baby! See, that's like one of this is like one of my favorite things. This is blue blue cars in general. The blue BMWs or like blue Mustangs are pretty sick too. All right. Oh wow, we're making. 9,215 so yeah we get a little bit of bonus extra money because um, everything is over 90% which is good so I think we're gonna end the video here everybody um, just a little bit of a quick one just getting a little uh, repair done on this FMW Panther um, not sure what I'm gonna do for next video probably I'm probably gonna go pick up a four-cylinder and do a nice uh, turbo swap on it but if you guys liked what you saw here, leave a like down below, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and I'll see everybody in the next Car Mechanic Simulator video.